Yo, welcome everyone. Bitcoin continues higher and it has almost hit our massive area of resistance at 65,000 US dollars. But in today's Bitcoin price prediction video, we really need to talk about why we are now pumping and also why we can expect much higher price targets in the upcoming months, not only on Bitcoin, but also on altcoins including ethereum but first as you most probably know if we zoom out on the daily time frame bitcoin has broken our very important and a massive symmetrical triangle towards the upside but at the moment we should also say this specific triangle is not invalidated why so because for now we are still trading below our previous high below our massive area of resistance where we do have our daily monthly and our weekly level i would say that as of right now looking at this if there is actually going to be another push towards downside we can still say okay we got a fake out out of our triangle and when we do see push towards downside of course a bounce can be expected at our very important areas of support however Personally, I wouldn't really go with a short or a sell position at the area where we are training at the moment because we are not really hitting our very important area of resistance just yet, which as it looks like it is actually going to be slightly higher. But the thing is, the moment we start breaking our area of resistance or most importantly, the moment we start breaking our previous high right here, we should talk about the elite waves of our rising wedge pattern. Let me right now share with you exactly what I have in mind. We are actually then going to be connecting our higher highs. Of course, if Bitcoin is going to be able to write and continue higher and that this right here is not actually a fake out. And also, then we are going to go with another diagonal area of support. So with this specific pattern, we are simply looking also pretty much to some kind of a five wave price structure. We are going to say we got our first wave right here, correction. Another push towards the upside for our third wave, another correction, and then another push towards the upset on bitcoin can actually be expected now after our five wave structure right here is actually finished the entire rising wedge pattern it's only going to be our first impulsive alien wave towards the upside after this one right here is going to be finished then we can be expecting a retracement for our second one and after that another significant impulsive push towards the upside most probably straight towards a brand new all-time high so this is right on the pattern that i'm as of right now monitoring on bitcoin for our third elite wave if of course once again we are going to continue higher in the upcoming days breaking above our previous high right here going above also our very important area of resistance but also one more thing here as you can notice our very important target that we can pay attention to for our third elite wave is simply going to be our weekly area of resistance and later in the video we are going to talk about the importance of this specific level but nevertheless right now i also do need to share with you another very important chart old street bats posted this specific elite wave count on his twitter profile literally only a couple of hours ago and he's as right now saying bitcoin will break out violently from this bull flag and i would definitely agree with him looking at a higher term time frame for example at the three week we can definitely notice that as right now bitcoin is still consolidating so overall speaking it looks like the fourth elite wave is as of right now finished already or potentially of course once again if the triangle is still valid we are still consolidating and forming the last elite wave right here that being said we are going to finish our fourth one in the upcoming days but doesn't really matter it looks like overall we are looking bullish on a higher term time frame expecting a massive breakout towards the upside on bitcoin and later in the video i'm also going to share with you some of my favorite altcoins that you can literally right now be looking to buy but before we do talk about that i would really appreciate if you're right now smash up the like button yesterday we got almost 600 likes but today we are definitely targeting 600 likes once again and also i would appreciate if you subscribe 
subscribe to the channel because we are targeting 100,000 subscribers, similarly as Bitcoin is also targeting 100,000 US dollars. Now, let's talk about, first of all, what is the area Bitcoin is trading at the moment? As you can notice, of course, we are not really trading at the area of resistance just yet. We are, as of right now, just slightly short of 65,000 US dollars. And if we are going to right now continue our way just slightly towards the upside, weekly area, monthly area, and also daily area of resistance are going to be hit. Very important areas for us to actually monitor simply because we have three high Trump time frame levels aligning literally at the exact same level. Additionally, what you're going to notice, we do have also right here two very important previous highs. And both of them are as of right now acting as liquidity levels. So what does it mean? People that are as of right now holding a short or a sell position, where are most probably their stop losses? Of course, they are going to be exactly above the high. Stop them out and only then potentially do see some kind of a rejection towards the downside. Now, here you need to be slightly more careful. If we once again take out our previous high, our triangle is going to be invalidated. And then, of course, as we mentioned, we are going to pay attention to our rising wedge pattern. But for example, if we are right now already going to see a rejection towards some side in the upcoming days, of course, we can still talk about our symmetrical triangle. And let me right now share with you why a rejection at this specific area can potentially happen. But personally, I am not trading it. When we go right now with different indicators, right? When we go with the RSI indicator, when we go with the money flow indicator, what are you going to notice right here? On a higher term time frame, all of them are, as I right saying, be slightly more careful because we are seeing the overbought area being hit on the RSI right here on the 4 hour time frame and also on the money flow indicator. Both of those very important indicators are right now agreeing we are being in the overbought area. Also, historically speaking, we were overbought on money flow at this specific level. We got a push towards downside on the Bitcoin price itself. And also, for example, right here, overbought on RSI, overbought on money flow right here, we got a push towards downside on the Bitcoin price itself. So as of right now, I'm still leaving the option open for us to still have this some kind of a fake out out of the triangle and for us to see a push towards downside. But the reality is the higher we go. And of course, also the moment we are going to break our previous high, the triangle is going to be invalidated. But let me right now also share with you why I am so bullish on altcoins. I am going to tell you exactly what I am buying or actually what I have been buying for the past couple of months. But first of all, when you pay attention to this very interesting chart from Max, he's right now saying that altcoins market cap found support at the long term upwards sloping trend line altcoin season incoming. So yes, it does look like that at the moment we are definitely trading at a very important area of support. We are seeing very similar consolidation as we have been seeing on Bitcoin literally for the past couple of months right here. And pretty much if you go right now with this specific chart, if we hit the support area, if we are right now seeing also consolidation pattern, this right here, in my opinion, definitely looks anything but bearish. We are looking definitely very nice and bullish right here. And that is simply why we can potentially be expecting a significant uptrend to simply continue. Looking at the historical price data on this specific chart, it also looks like we got a breakout in our previous cycle, some kind of a bull flag, and then simply an uptrend definitely continued towards a brand new all-time high. But now additionally, we are even retesting the area of support, similarly what we also did already a couple of months ago, and after that, some of the altcoins, including Bitcoin, continued much higher towards the upside. So if you're right now wondering what altcoins I am personally as a right now buying, now I would simply go on the coin market cap and sort our altcoins by the best performing ones because first of all i would like to tell you what i have been buying but i'm not going to tell you that you should buy them right now because for example when you sort for the best performance in the past seven days you're going to notice that for example sui tao and also celestia right here both of those three i have been buying for the past couple of months i would not buy them right now because of course we have gotten a significant push towards the upside on all of them so all i would do right here i would definitely add them in the favorites and once they do see some kind of a retracement buy a little bit more of both of those three they are very very good projects i am as of right now still accumulating now i'm also as of right now going to sort them by the worst performing ones and with them you can already
probably be looking to buy some of them. And one of my favorites, it's actually going to be OM or Mantra right here. A great project. I am definitely super bullish on this one. And also, if we scroll even lower right here, you're going to find, for example, Render, a super good project. I would definitely be looking to buy even more of this one. And also one of them that is, in my opinion, one of the best one is going to be Arweave or AR. So this one also has gotten quite a significant push towards the upside. And in my opinion, it is definitely going to perform very, very well. And also, by the way, if you're looking to buy those altcoins, you can right now literally secure an insane free bonus on Bybit, Blofin, and Bing X Exchange. Bybit at the moment, it is actually offering an insane 30,000 US dollar free bonus. If you're going to click the first link down below, register, and after initial deposit, you're going to secure some insane bonuses. And additionally, if you maybe don't want to complete KYC, you can still get a 10,000 US dollar free bonus on Blofin by the end of 23rd of September. So at the moment, time is definitely running out, but the bonuses are available to you with the links down below after you click the link, register, and after initial deposit. Now, let's also talk about another very important chart and that is not going to be bitcoin because of course we know that bitcoin most probably it is going to perform very very well in the upcoming months what if we pay close attention to the ethereum price and because of that i would like to share with you this specific very interesting picture very interesting post from yoda he's right now saying that ethereum is giving you a generational entry right now and it does look like when we zoom out on the 15 day chart it looks like we are as of right now simply retesting quite an important area of support right here and usually it is best to keep our charts as simple as possible we got a very similar retest already back in 2020 and after that a significant bull market Market, a significant push towards the upside to almost 5,000 US dollars actually occurred. And again, the history usually does not repeat exactly, but it definitely rhymes. So once you pay attention to this specific chart, retesting the area of support as of right now, and he's pretty much talking about the price target of approximately 10,000 US dollars. And I would agree with him. It looks like that this specific target, it is actually quite a realistic one. And that is why if we do continue higher, not only on Bitcoin, but of course also on the altcoins because they are right on trading at such an important area of support, we can definitely be expecting also a significant push towards the upside on the Ethereum price, also potentially creating generational wealth. Now, let's go right now back into the Bitcoin chart itself because I do need to share with you another very important level. And this level is going to be our next target. We know that right now, first of all, our target is going to be the 65,000 US dollars area. But what if we start going even higher towards the upside then you need to pay very close attention to another high term time frame area of resistance which is simply going to be 68,300 US dollars now why is this such an important level when we zoom out on the daily time frame and measuring literally the entire price action you are going to notice that our point of control on bitcoin is going to come up slightly lower than our weekly area of resistance so because of that i would simply say this right here is then going to be our next important price target you should definitely be aware of if bitcoin does continue higher and as we mentioned before we are then simply going to look for us to potentially then end our third wave of our rising wedge pattern at this specific area potentially do see a rejection towards downside another push up and only then break it towards downside but overall speaking this right here a very important target you should right now be aware of but on the other hand what if we don't go higher what if we are simply going to go lower towards downside as we already mentioned yesterday we are going to get bearish only if the market structure is going to be changed we need to start forming lower highs and also lower lows and also another level that you can right now pay attention to is simply going to be value area high of the entire bottom price action right here and this level is going to come up exactly at 61,360 us dollars which as you can see right here it is aligning very very nicely with our previous highs so the moment we break this specific level and the moment we do see acceptance below our value area low it is going to be some kind of a bearish bitcoin indication until our value area low it's acting as the area of support until we are trading in such a nice uptrend on the four hourly two hourly and one hourly time frame i would definitely say expect higher as of right now wait for us to see the reaction above our previous high yes potentially we can be looking for some kind of a short or a sell position above the high but definitely note you are short 
shorting clearly in an uptrend. However, as we mentioned before, if the RSI and money flow are both overbought on the 4 hour time frame, and if the reaction is going to be a very nice one, that being said, swing failure pattern, liquidity grab pushed towards some side, yes, we might even be interested to go with a brand new short or a sell position right here on the Bitcoin price. And now, if you want to trade with us, secure an insane 30,000 US dollar free bonus on Bybit with the first thing down below after you register and after initial deposit and also thank you very much for smashing up the like button.